Hello, this is Tony at Tony's Music and administrator of Doodly and Tooly PNGs. I'm going to start a new project on Create Studio. I'm going to show you how to do the pan and zoom. So, I'm going to call it pan and zoom video. Oops, I made a mistake there. Wait a minute. Okay, right, I'm going to change it to 1080p high definition and create project. Obviously, it'll be a blank project at the moment. What I'm going to do now is just go straight to studio, go into backgrounds, and I'm going to put in some backgrounds for you. And what I'm going to do now is try and find the ones with the Benches on as an example, would be a good one for doing that one. That's them, yeah. Right, there's the one that won first, that was the first one. So there's the first scene, and I get to the end of the first scene, I'm going to put the next piece on, which is that piece, and then I'm going to get to the next scene, which is going to be that scene. And go to the next scene, which is that scene. And one, that's to show you there's more than one scene on, right? And we will just play that for you, just to see, show you how it's going at the moment. Right? Okay. Not a lot happening because I ain't got any characters on, but we ain't gonna worry about the characters. I'm just gonna show you how to the pan, do the pan and zooming, and you don't really need the cameras for that at the moment. You can just use your imagination to see what I'm on about. This is where I'm gonna do the pan and zooming on this part here, because the person's gonna be walking towards that bench, right? But I'm gonna show you how to do it properly, right? So that's the end of that, right? That's how it looks, right? From the start to the finish. Right now, what you need to do is you click on here, around there somewhere, right? And you go onto your camera up here, click on the camera. Now, you don't just whip that in. What you need to do is you go on the track part here, look for camera there, click on the plus button there, and you get this up, right? Now, you go over here, click on this bit here. Uh -huh. on there, like that. So you go there, right? Now here, you pull that down to there, right? To where you want it about, somewhere about there, right? So if you look at that, when you put that back, all these will be right size, and then it goes down to there, right? Now once you've done that, you do another click on here, and then you go from there. And you get to this one. On this one, you want to go and take it over there. Right, so it'll be from there to there. And then you can stretch that out if you want to to make it take a bit longer. Like that. Right, so you just like that. Across there. And then you want to take it out just before you get to the next one. So you need to add another plus sign that one and then from there you go from there and then you go out on that end could it come up there like that and you click it out back to the original size you want it right bring it all the way out as much as you can seems a bit awkward at first but that's it right now you can move these along where you want to like that right so you do that right so I'll show you how it looks now. Right, so there's the start off. There's nothing uh, happening with the zoom, pan and zoom there. And go through to the second picture, there's nothing happening with the pan and zoom there. Right, now we get on to the next picture and it should zoom in straight away. Zooming in. Now it's panning along to where the bench is. And then it stays there, then it'll zoom out. Then when you go on to the next picture, it's back to normal. 
that's how you do it right now you can use these and you can move these any way you want and they'll zoom in wherever they are on the board so you can move it so it stops there and zoom in on that one instead and zoom out there so we'll have a look at that now and I'll show you how that looks now it'd be totally different because it'd be a different it'd be on that bench instead of that bench right so let's show you that okay that's nothing there at the moment now we're going on to the next one and it'll zoom in straight away there you go it's panning across to the bench and then near the end it will zoom back out ready for the next shot okay so yeah, once you've clicked on the camera there always click on the track down to get the camera there and use the plus sign there to put them up and you can put them up wherever you want to it don't matter where you start them off you can do them anywhere you want and then drag them along and then it'll work all right for you okay i hope this helps anyway um if you like this video please like and subscribe to tony's music and thank you very much for watching my program thank you